This is Duke University. Off. We've got over 190 students here this year showing off presentations and projects that have been the culmination of their research experiences, working with faculty deeply immersed, some of these folks in laboratories, some of these folks with brains. Some of these folks have been out in the field here in Durham and all over the world working on problems of healthcare, working on problems of economic development, working on problems of education and psychology. I'm not going to be able to say this from memory. <laughs> All right. All right. Um, hi, my name is Ani Saraswatla. I'm a senior, and my project is uh, decreased regulatory B cell levels in glioblastoma patients are unchanged by peptide vaccine administration despite an elevation in serum bliss. From the Brun to Hitler, how the art of human physiognomy has codified stereotype in our visual culture. Okay. Hi, my name is Jennifer Hewitt, and my project is titled E. coli. I'm gonna put on this slide so much harder. Okay. Hi, my name is Jennifer Hewitt, and the title of my project is Preliminary Evaluation of E. coli as Host for Second Generation Electrophiles Processes. Alright, name is Rebecca Laylek, and my title is The Effect of Noodle One Knockout on Epidermal Cell Migration in Wound Healing. I'm Florian Kran, I'm a junior. I'm Rachel Roberts, I'm a senior. I can already tell we're going to see the thing. But can we go over it first? Can we talk about it first? Is that a good Can we get like two seconds? Two paper applications in four and five years. Are you ready? All right. Go. Doing math, math with dot arrays, behavioral, behavioral implications for five four and five year old creatures. I'm Kirsten Osborne, and my title is Boys in Tutus, Girls in Bow Ties, Gender Representations in Picture Books. Hi, my name is Annie Smirillo, and the title of my research is High Glitazone Increases Corticosteroid Effects in Obese Asthmatic Subjects. So close. So close. You know what? <laughs> yeah. Dang it. <laughs> this is what it really means to be an educated person. This is what it means to make a transition from student to scholar. And this is what it means to be able to live in the world. Research is not an end unto itself. It really is training for life. Produced by Duke University. Online at duke.edu.